Hey, thanks for tuning into our channel again. Today we're going to be talking about our product Cozy Bump and some of the new features that are on it, such as the breast section here, the face section so you can lay face down, breathing holes so you can breathe when you're laying face down, and different positions to put your neck for comfort, as well as if you stay through to the end, right here you'll be able to see what's going to happen if it pops. And another added thing as well is somewhere throughout the video, I'm not going to tell you where, we're going to give you a special discount code for things like Cozy Bump and some of our other products as well. Have fun. Hey, thanks for tuning to our channel again. What we're going to do is we're going to be going over the new benefits of the newer Cozy Bump. It still has some of the old benefits from the old Cozy Bump model, like such as the decon the leg section, the, the two different separate air chamber, chambers, one being in the belly hole area, the other one being in the body. Um, the quick uh, Boston valve relief, release, which allows you to quickly inflate and deflate the Cozy Bump as well. But some of the, the exciting new features that a lot of you expecting mothers were asking for is we now have a cutout section for the breasts, so you're not going to have to worry about that being pressed on and uncomfortable during the pregnancy, as well as we have a face hole. This is, is good if you're going to get a massage or if you're tired of your head being twisted in one direction, you can then twist your head forward and then we added a, a breathing hole as well here. Um, we're going to have her lie down now on it. How many months pregnant are you? Eight months. Eight months pregnant. Okay, so she's eight months pregnant. She's having a boy. Uh, we're going to show her currently use it. Uh, the swaddle is what we provide with every Cozy Bump purchase. You're going to be placing that over the Cozy Bump like such. And the reason why you're doing that is because during pregnancy, a lot of the pains are coming from gravity. So if you're going to be lying here, gravity is again going to be sucking on the center of your stomach, which can then hurt your upper and lower back if you don't have something cradled in yourself. So we're going to put the swaddle on here. Do a light press in there just to give a little bit more comfort and let's have you lie on it. When you're lying on the cozy bump, make sure if you, uh, the bump is going to be right at your hip section. And you ease your stomach into the hole to make sure you fit your comfort. Now, if the bump is a little too hard, which sometimes it might be, you might have inflated it too much, you can simply, let me just reach over here real quick. You can simply, as a mom, you can reach in and you can, she can reach in and touch this valve right here and let out some of the air, which will start to relieve some, some of the pressure. Okay, as well as, can you just lie face down real quick? Okay, so if you're going to get a massage, you're typically going to have to lay on your side. It's going to be rather uncomfortable because you're not getting the full relaxation of your back. Um, and that now, with the Cozy Bump, you'll be able to lie face down, but be able to target the back of your head, your neck, and all of your upper neck muscles. You can pull your head back up, yeah. Okay, but some of you mothers don't want to just lie face down. So what you'll do is you'll have to adjust yourself. And the best way to adjust yourself is bringing, uh, let's say if your head's going to go to the right like hers, bringing that left shoulder forward, and then having your head go as far over the edge as you can, so that your neck's not going to be twisted up like this, but it'll be twisting just over. How do you feel? Comfortable? Very comfortable. All right, great. Do you feel like you're pregnant? I do not feel like I'm pregnant. <laughs> All right, uh, in just a second, I'm gonna show something else as well. Uh, a lot of pregnant mothers have been asking the question, what happens if it pops? If it pops, it's a great question. But the Cozy Bump is designed to, if it were to pop, there's backup features. There's two air chambers. The center bump, which is what we showed you where the adjustable valve is at right now. If the main body of the, of the bed popped, the center bump would be inflated and you wouldn't have to worry about it. If the bump pops, the body of the bed is inflated, you wouldn't have to worry about it. In just a second, I'm going to show you what it's going to look like if it were to pop. Okay, so we talked about, I was going to show the feature. If the Cozy Bump were to pop, I talked about the two additional features, one being that the air bump, it still has air in it. So if the main body were to, were to pop, the center bump would keep you up. And if the center bump were to pop, the body has just enough air in it to keep you up as well. But now I want to talk about what happens if it were to pop itself. If someone were to come by, or a cat, or someone, a sharp object might have poked it, right? I'm going to show you right now. As you can see, it's not blowing up. She has just enough time you can get up, to get up, take your time, completely safe. Hey, thanks for watching our video. If you're interested in learning more tips and tricks on how to help with back pain during pregnancy, make sure you hit the subscribe button to be alerted when we come out with new videos. In addition, if you're looking for more information right now, click this next video here.